Hi everyone, welcome to my new channel again. The Scottish Squirrel. I chose the Scottish Squirrel because, well, I'm Scottish. And sometimes when I go shopping and then I come home and put it all in my pantry and reorganise it and sort it out and tidy it up, I just kind of feel like a squirrel squirrelling away. <laughs> so, yeah. Anyway, I thought I'd do a What I Eat in a Day video. And it's just because I love watching videos like this. But before lockdowns happened, I didn't really watch YouTube much. And I didn't even know these types of videos existed. So, yeah, but I'm glad to have discovered them. Okay, so this morning I'm having Asda Cornflakes. Just the Asda own brand. They're like 50p for a box of 500 grams, I think. And they're really cheap, but they're actually really quite tasty. If you're used to like Kellogg's and things, then it might take like a few tries to get used to the Asda brand. But after a while, you just don't notice. <laughs> and it actually tastes quite nice. So I'm just having a banana chopped up and I've got the very smallest bit of maple syrup drizzled on top of the cornflakes. Because I used to add like sugar but I was just trying to cut that out. So I've got my coffee, which is just usual, and it's Nescafe Gold Barista style, which is nice, especially when you can get the big tub on offer, which I don't usually buy it when it's not on offer. And for in my cornflakes, I've put this soya soel, which is good, which is quite nice. And I get that from Asda on a subscribe and save each month and I get eight cartons and it's £8.75 for eight cartons, which is a bargain, I would say. And this Alpro Oat No Sugars is what I use in my coffee, basically because I get the Alpro from the local co-op and it's really quite dear. So yeah, I don't want to just like shove it in my cornflakes. So I put this so well in my cornflakes. So yeah, so this is what I'm going to have and it's Sunday, 21st of February. Yeah, it's really hard to keep track of the days. Anyway, I'll see you back when I've put lunch out in a few hours. Hi again, good afternoon. I hope you're all having a lovely Sunday. So for today's lunch, I've just heated up some of the Morrison's classic vegetable soup which is there because we're in a bit of a hurry just come back from a dog walk and wanted something fast i guess and just having that with some of my homemade whole meal irish soda bread and with some cherry tomatoes and the little pills are my vitamin d because we live up the highlands with hardly any sun and vitamin b12 because that's also recommended for everyone to have that. I'm just having that with a glass of water and I spread my toast with some Vitalite plant-based because that's tasty. So yeah, that's what we're having for lunch and I'll see you at tea time. Good afternoon everyone again. It's 25 past three. I'm just having my, a wee afternoon tea. I'm having some coffee. It's made with Nescafe Gold Blend Alt Arica, which is really a nice one. That's my last coffee of the day though, so it'll be two. I'm having some of this Oatly Barista, which because it makes the coffee really creamy. And as a little pick-me-up, I'm having a few squares of the Linda Excellent Caramel with a touch of sea salt, dark chocolate and it smells really good so well, hopefully that's nice because I've never tried that before so okay well I hope you're all having a lovely afternoon hi everyone again it's dinner time <laughs> and it's 20 past six and dark outside so yeah I usually have dinner a bit earlier, but we went out for a longer, another dog walk, so yeah. Anyway, here we have Scottish mince and tatties. Traditional Scottish mince and tatties, 
apart from the minces, plant-based mints, but everything is exactly the same as when I was growing up. My mum used to make the mints. It's exactly the same, mostly. <laughs> and we've got baby potatoes in it and some steamed butternut cabbage. And if you would like the recipe for the mints, then just let me know and I'll stick it down below in the bio part, I think it is. But it's just a pack of this mints and a little bit of Worcester sauce, some soy sauce, some gravy powder, carrot, celery, onion, garlic, and mixed herbs. Yeah, and that's pretty simple, but very, very tasty. And we all love this cabbage. So yeah, so there is the big pan, still cooking because I haven't put the kids out yet. And more potatoes and more cabbage. So yeah. Can't wait to start eating this. And yeah, the chocolate, I'm just gonna let you know. The chocolate, that Linda salty caramel one that I had for afternoon tea was not very nice. And I won't be buying that one again. It was too salty and had a funny artificial taste. <laughs> so yeah, I won't be buying that one again. So, okay. So I shall catch you later. Bye.